Hey, so I did start my makeup off camera. I already have my eyebrows filled in and I have some foundation on as well as some luxury Benai banana powder under my eyes, on my chin, uh, right along my T-zone. And so I'm going to start this video off with my eyes. I'm applying some Hoola bronzer as eyeshadow with a fluffy blending brush right now. I'm applying it in my crease and right along my eyelid. Of course, I'm doing the other eye. Um, I like to start in the crease first and then just blend everything out onto my eyelid because I like my, my crease to be deeper. Later on, I'm gonna go in with a darker color. But right now, I'm just blending, blending this. And I also have some chapstick on just to keep my lips moist. So when I apply my lipstick or lip gloss, it will go on smoothly. <laughs> I realize I do a lot of weird faces, so please forgive me. <laughs> Okay, next I'm grabbing my Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter and I'm adding it in my inner corner with this really tiny brush. I'm not sure what it is, it's just a really small little brush. And I'm just adding it until I think it's bright enough. Now I'm grabbing this other little brush. It's a little bit more fluffy and I'm using it to highlight my brow. Yeah, I'm applying it under my arch of my brow, right underneath. I'm not bringing it too far down and then I'm just adding a little bit more and I'm just applying a little bit more where I added the highlighter before in my inner corner just because I'm extra and now I'm grabbing this fluffy brush and I'm blending the powder that I had setting under my eyes all over my face I'm just buffing it in with this fluffy brush to smooth my skin out a little bit more and now I'm gonna use this concealer that I'm using it's actually not a concealer, I'm using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation that I am wearing already just to put it on these spots that I have, these pimples, oh my god. <laughs> I actually shot this video last year and I was going through a stressful time. So my skin was really going crazy, like I had bad breakouts. Well to me it was really bad. Um, that's why I also started the video with my foundation and my powder on because I was afraid to show my skin and show the outbreak that I was, I was going through. But my skin actually has cleared up a lot. Um, I'm basically glowing again. Glowing, glowing. Thank you, God. So yeah, I'm just applying a little bit more of the foundation on these spots. Just to conceal it a little bit more. Um, this foundation doesn't really get cakey on my skin. So it works out fine. Now I'm moving back to the eyes and I'm going in with a deeper color. It's actually just the NYX eyebrow palette that I use for my brows. I'm just using the darker color in the crease just to give it more definition. And then I'm going back in with my fluffy brush. I know I'm grabbing a different fluffy brush. This one is actually bigger and I'm using it to apply my Hoola bronzer. I love this bronzer so much. It looks so good. I'm applying it on my cheekbones, right under my cheekbones, on my forehead, just along my hairline and under my jawline. And now I'm just gonna blend, blend, blend because I don't need any harsh lines. We need this to blend in and look just like skin. Then I'm actually grabbing the same brush that I used to do my eyeshadow, the small blending fluffy brush. And I'm using that to apply the bronzer along my nose and I'm using the bronzer to contour my nose lightly. For some reason I feel like I'm twanging so I'm gonna try and stop. I'm gonna try and talk more like myself. Anyways, so... I'm using the bronzer to contour my nose and I'm going to do two small lines going down the, the bridge of my nose and straight down to the tip. And that's basically just going to sharpen my nose a little bit, make it look more straight and narrow. I also put a little bit under my lip and right on my cupid's bow, not where the two bulgy parts are, just where it sinks in. I don't know what that part's called, so forgive me. <laughs> Then I'm grabbing my setting spray. It's actually just rose water in a spray bottle from another setting spray that I used previously. Um, I find that rose water actually helps my skin not to break out and it sets the makeup really well as well. I put the setting spray on now because I'm gonna add the highlights and I want the highlights to really stick. 
And I find that the highlighter sticks best when it's either wet, when I wet the brush or when I wet my skin first and then apply the highlighter. Of course I'm just packing it on, adding it right on my cheekbone, right down the bridge of my nose, on the tip of my nose, as well as on my cupid's bow right above my lip. Then I grab my blush and I'm using a fluffy brush again just to apply some blush between where I add my bronzer and where I applied my highlighter. And blush is really just to give you some rosiness, like you, you know like when you're blushing and you're flirting, like it's like the blood rushes to certain parts of your face. So I just use it to make it look more natural. To me it looks more natural because I have that with my natural skin. And then I grab my lip liner, I'm actually using the MAC Cosmetics Soar lip liner and I'm just going to line my lip real quick. But I always start with my top lip and... I'm not the best at lining my lips, but I love using a liner. I feel like the lipstick looks way better. Sometimes you can even just use a lip liner and a lip gloss and you're ready to go. The lips just pop more. And now I'm just going to grab this small fluffy brush and I'm going to apply some of the Hoola bronzer on my bottom lash line. Right across it. Oh my god, I got some in my eyes. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I'm just applying it across the bottom lash line and I'm just rubbing a little bit on my, my top lash line as well just to blend everything out and spray 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 I love setting spray I really do um, it just make it feel like it's my skin you know what I'm saying you know, you know what I'm saying <laughs> Anyways, grabbing this mascara I don't remember what it is I think it's physician's formula black waterproof mascara but yeah that's what it is and I'm grabbing that and I'm just applying some on my bottom lashes because I already have lashes on as you can tell. And of course I grab my fluffy brush just to finish it off with a little bit more blush. And then I grab a lipstick. This is the YSL lipstick in nude, I think. I'm not sure. Um, and yeah, just use that to blend the lip liner with the lipstick into my lips. And spray, spray, spray. And that's it. Alright guys, no holds yeah, down, don't come back. No, 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 you want to get compensation for the war and strife <laughs> You want to help me and make all the money Everything love is all I bring And everybody who's in love Looking at your lover's eyes I sing 